All right, so this is gonna go through the quinta sequence. It's just a Kang squat in reverse, but it's confusing because it's like eight parts. Uh, so remember, we wanna have a athletic stance in the knees, we wanna have our back stiff. Upper body, so this whole thing shouldn't change. So no matter where I'm at, it's my body right here. None of this upper body stuff changes. I don't know if you your hands, eventually you're gonna have a barbell on your back, 45 pound barbell. Right now, put your hand in your chest or here. The so first thing, we hinge with the hips. Back and legs straight, athletic stance to the knees. We're gonna squat down. My upper body stays right here. So now, I can see the bottom of the neck and squat. I'm gonna lift my hips back up. Move it nice and slow. Right here, I mean, right here specifically, I'm extending my legs. My, my athletic stance to the knee is gone. I'm stretching the hamstring. As I stand up, rotating my feet out so my glutes are warmed up. And I'm gonna do that same thing in reverse. I'm gonna squat down, nice good squat. Throw my hips up, my head doesn't move. Fully extending the knees, coming back down to that nice squat. Upper body here, and back up. Again, from the front. Watch my knees, you're out. Building all that tension, everything is tight in the lower body. Back down, squat down. Hips up. All at all points, my feet are all on the ground. Oh, that's not scary, no, we're good. All right, so real time. Suckers. Go slow. Good for you.